The Pianos About Town program is a public-private partnership that includes the City of Fort Collins, the Bohemian Foundation, and the Downtown Development Authority. We start with a generous gift of a piano from a community member that's looking for a new home for their piano. And from that, we pick up the pianos free of charge and move them to our storage area. And in that site, we prep and prepare them for their adventure out into the world around Fort Collins. And at this point, once those pianos are prepared, the painting begins. And then they start their journey. And those pianos are moved every two to three weeks with some locations um, maybe six to 12 weeks long. Well, the program uh, was initially inspired by a British artist named uh, Luke Jerram, who um, had a touring exhibit in 2010 that included uh, stops all around the world and it stopped in New York City in 2010. That gave us the idea to do it here in Fort Collins and it's been a great success so far. This is a very unique collaboration and it's the kind we like where you involve multiple uh, organizations. So we helped with the funding and coordinated with, with the city and uh, the Downtown Development Authority and made the project happen. It's, uh, we learned a lot of things along the way but it's been a great gift to the community and it's been utilized very well uh, by the people. It's uh, brought a lot of joy not only to the people who play the pianos but the people who are out in the community enjoying the noise. We placed our first pianos out in the holiday season in 2010 in Old Town Square and so from that point um, I think we've painted over 64 pianos, murals to date. We keep seven to eight pianos out during the winter time um, maybe 12 to 14 pianos during the summer season, but you can always catch a glimpse of them in the Mitchell Block building in their windows on Mountain Avenue. We keep it exciting, so we keep those pianos moving, and we have about 20 locations for those pianos around town with an emphasis in Old Town Square. You see them all over the place and it's great that you can, you know, walk around and you hear people playing them and you see little kids, you know, coming up to them in families and then you'll see, you know, teenagers and the cool kids hanging out and goofing around on them and it's great to just hear music kind of ringing around throughout Old Town. You know, music is a huge part of this town and, and uh, you can kind of see it everywhere you look. I think this is a signature piece that Fort Collins provides and, and I believe that like a lot of what keeps us going here is tourism and we have visitors coming from all over the world and all over the country uh, to come in and see our downtown and be a part of our arts community and this is just like a little cherry on the cake. I love that any time of day where I feel like I want to go I can go downtown with surrounded by awesomeness and everybody you know the whole culture of Fort Collins and still sit down and play a real piano and then you know people love it too people like to walk by and I'll see sometimes people will stop by and, and stay for a few minutes and I, I think it benefits everybody it benefits little kids that wouldn't normally hear this kind of music um, you know even people you know less fortunate that haven't played on a piano in years can walk right up and, and play a piano and I think that's amazing I think that Fort Collins has gotten so great about um, music that this just kind of tops it off. We want it to be discovery. You might have seen it in this location at one time and then it'll be across town in an alley somewhere else. So I think uh, logistically and the number and that we're always moving them for new discoveries and to find new audiences is really innovative for this program. Well, I think one of the things that's really innovative about this project is the is the component of the public and private partnership. Uh, we don't see that enough in, in, um, in many communities and we're really making it work here uh, in Fort Collins. I think the other thing that's interesting, besides the intersection of, of two different art forms, uh, is the fact that it's happening outside in Colorado. When a lot of people think about Colorado, they think about snow and inclement weather and, and uh, really it does reflect the beauty of, of Colorado in an outside environment and it's not, it's a surprise. It's not what you would expect. I think what's unique to Fort Collins is that we like to show our visual artists front and center also. 
So the act of creating the mural and for the public to interact with the artist is something very much Fort Collins. I love Fort Collins because I, I believe that we are this hotbed of artistic activity. And when all the arts, the different kind of arts, link arms and, and join together, it just becomes so much more dynamic for our community. First of all, it creates an ambiance in a town like this where it's a big music town and people love music. And it also provides the opportunity to be creative spontaneously. So if you play piano and you're walking along and you have a song in your head and you can just sit down and create music right there on the spot and people get to enjoy it immediately. So it's sort of a instant gratification of music. Whimsy is part of the human experience and I think sometimes we cut ourselves off from giving ourselves a chance to express um, the way we're feeling and what we're thinking and I think the pianos is a, a symbol and a tool for people to do just that. I think uh, the pianos do give uh, a spontaneous interaction with the community which is unique in communities. Think about you know something that is always out there for the community to enjoy and so unique to have playable pianos outside. I mean we get calls from across the country to ask, how do you start a program like this? And it's because this program's been so successful and that the communities love those pianos too. It's really neat when you have a couple of art forms joining uh, in, in one environment. And so to have a uh, physical artist that paints join a, a musical artist down the road, that's a pretty unique collaboration, just like the collaboration between Bohemian and the city of Fort Collins. So it's, uh, it's great to think out of the box and uh, to see those two things come together. It's pretty magical.